Nemi, cheese, sambalen, kruffan, skaven, an eccentric meal, hesse. How are you all today? Hopefully I didn't miss anyone. Yeah, I got to say uh, hesse is uh, not quite for it was the best so far, so... Sorry, cheese. I think you need to read more poetry to make it work. But yes, how are you all today? I guess we should jump straight into the game before it breaks. All the I was thinking something similar, but it was a bit too dark. The dark one is there. Anna is there now too. A bit too dark. Do you remember the poet the that I actually uh, read in the Discord about the swing? Do you remember that one? If you can make it darker, I will be impressed. Hello, gorgeous lady. Okay. Hmm. I'm happy to hear you. Okay. I am nervous mostly. I'm very nervous. 
not that dark. Then don't say it's dark. Can you take the fifth? The what now? Waking up still even being awake signs. 8 a.m. Too much snow. Oh, have you gotten any coffee yet? And hi, Rach. How are you today? I want to make up and looking amazing. Oh, thank you. It's dark because cheese turns the lights off. That makes sense. God damn it, cheese. Why would you do it? That's why you were so blurry for so many streams now. Twitch decided to turn you 360p. Wow. It's the American thing for no comment. Ah, uh, okay, okay. No. It is okay too. You in the mood for the Lord. You know, great poetry, but it's very naughty. A variant on roses are writing you. Oh dear. You told Winter he had to go to sleep, but he refused to rip the electric cables out. Why did you rip the electric cables out out of Winter's house? It's kind of mean, you know. Remember early 2000s when 360p was HD? Mm -hmm. It's kind of funny though. Can't imagine. <coughs> A lovely queen, thank you. You had to go sleep. Mm hmm. By whose order? Yours? Oh, Winter. Maybe he was in the middle of something important and you just got rid of his electricity. That's kind of mean. May have also needed some copper. <laughs> I assume that there is a variant like that out of it. It is. It's that day, but you're gonna hold a strain on yourself not to go overboard because you're insanely angry. Control the emotions, right? Is there things that would make you less angry? Or like, does a venting make you lesser angry about things? Or like, is there anything that like, kind of lets it out? Because I do know that some people would always recommend to like, go punch a bag or something. But the thing with it is there is also studies that sometimes you like uh, using your aggression to like um, channeling it through to punching bag, for example, is just going to like raise the amount of aggression inside of you. So it might not be like a good idea because it just like causes more of it. But I think that's also like a people dependent possibly. Hi dearies, how are you today? Alright, it's not as easy to grab as the farming games make it out to be. Mm -hmm. Need to breathe in and what's something. Okay, well I hope that it calms down eventually. Just take your time. And it's okay, like, uh, uh, trust me, I make two posts all the time and I write and I usually can't even read things correctly, so it might be that indeed. At least, like, I read a study about it at some point. Quite a few studies that sometimes, you know, you kind of, like, living the aggression as, like, uh, well, punching the back, for example. It's just gonna, like, get you more angry. Of course, it will, like, physically, eventually, probably exhaust you, but... Yeah. And hi Russ, how are you today? You look amazing. Thank you. Poor bag. Exactly. Poor feet. Good but tired AF. How's the queen looking fabulous today? Oh, thank you. And happy to hear you good. 
Hopefully you get some proper rest eventually. Have you gotten a chance to sleep at all yet? Thank you. Um, yeah, Q is mostly just nervous. Very nervous, I think. Okay, my chat is still being weird. Like, it doesn't always update the messages immediately. No. Nope. Punching bag is destroyed by the cats, so... Oh, the cats were angry. That first part still doesn't rhyme, cheese. That just doesn't rhyme. Leave it out. No, you have been too hyped. Ear is still ringing. Ah, oh, fair. Can understand that. Well, the cats are out of aggression, then. Yes. It is not! Jeez, rhymes don't work like that. For fuck's sake. You got eight hours of sleep, which is odd. Because you usually have to get up to go to the restroom mid-sleep, so you feel great. Hmm. I'm happy to hear that like you feel great about it, and that you actually got proper amount of sleep. Really cool you guys haven't seen you angry. I agree. I don't like seeing people angry. Like, uh, people being angry makes me extremely uncomfortable. It's not about them being angry, it's more about, like, it reminds me of my uh, childhood. And then, like, it snaps uh, something. So I prefer not to see people angry. What if Spanish rhymes do? Well, the thing is, then it rhymes in Spanish, but it doesn't make it rhyme in English. And that doesn't rhyme because it's literally the two same words. For fuck's sake, I please. just needed you to know. I love you. Thank you for the hack. I appreciate it. Plus, jeez, before you get into the uh, Spanish rhyming in the chat, remember, please keep the chat in either English or Finnish. I will usually still uh, answer in English, though, so everyone will understand, but... Yes, and keep it in English, so... Because otherwise the mods won't have a goddamn clue what you're saying. Cheese is cheesy. Mm -hmm. These poem beauty standards are too high. Then... Don't do poetry. Don't do it, cheese. You can read it, but you don't need to make it. Also, if I remember correctly, not all poetry even rhymes, but like, you are trying to make it rhyme even though you don't need to make it rhyme. Fine, you'll make haiku instead. Rhymes and poems are quite an odd. Did not show the rest. They're not the same thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> that was cool fun. <laughs> and for fuck's sake, no hikes. <laughs> Or you could read the Finnish poem called Keino. People who know, they know. It's a dark one, to put it lightly. I don't know yet, running on third three hours of sleep. There. Hopefully you'll get some proper rest eventually. And coffee. You like dark ones. Well, if you are not familiar with it, I would say read it, because, yeah, I was light feeling that it's not all of it to be written on the chat. So, I think it was called Keino. Roses are red blooms. Dolphins dance in ocean. 
deep. Nature's vibrant hues. You totally thought of this yourself. You're so cool. Uh, did you steal that from the chat GBD or something? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that's how we know that she's is using that GPT or something similar. You should have asked Dante. Yes. You should have. Although I was scared what he would come up with that. <laughs> right, we also have the game. Boop. Oh yeah, it saves. A moment ago. I guess we both should be very scared and like what Dante would come up with that. Uh, <laughs> somebody is dying. So, who is this girl again? A hostage. We'll use her for negotiating with the Order. Just make sure she wears a gas mask. If she's infected, she's dead and of no use to us. So what do we do with her? Log her up and keep an eye on her. Anything happens, it's your head. I'll come get her when you die. There was dance again, her running. of the red line to stop the epidemic and you're all infected you heard the man they must kill you to save the metro but but we're not even feverish we're fire somebody had an asthma attack yes Yeah, I think no matter how fast I try to do that sequence, it still ends that way that they die. Can't you get anything? You look point blank face. Unbelievable. I fucked up. Okay, so I need to load to the last checkpoint because otherwise that. Innocent person is gonna lit on fire. So I fucked up. Oh, it throws me here. How oh, lovely. Okay, well, at least now I know. Yeah, I need to change the freaking thingy so I don't redo that. I really hate it when it sometimes does that. Yeah. And yeah, now it's still throwing knives. <laughs> No thoughts were given about the fire. Uh -huh. hostage. We'll use her for negotiating with the order. Just make sure she wears a gas mask. If she's infected, she's dead. And of I no did meet her worry today. So what do we do with her? Log her up and keep an eye on her. Anything happens, it's your head. I'll come get her when you're done here. Okay, yeah, so it's scripted that you can't simply say them. This is great, you have been working 
your friend Scooter, little punk rock one to coming up. Nice. Happy to hear you're doing just great. Hey, you. I'm done for. So, so listen, the Reds. They knew of the infection. They came on the second day. No one had died yet, but they came with the flamers. How else could they have known? Go, tell everyone. Tell it. It was the Reds. No, no, no. Oh, not this shit again. Oh, fucking hell. Sorry for that. It shows that for a moment because the game just decided once again that it's on the left monitor. The mouse and not on the main monitor. Fucking hate it when games do that. It's very fucking uh, annoying. I don't know why it keeps doing it. Still annoys me nonetheless. How the fuck none of those actually hit him? What? Damn it. That's annoying. With your yapping soldier. We're short of people for the unloading operation, so go and get those two on the double. They have to be at the storage in two minutes. Go! No. Yes, sir. Go! Yes, sir, and he doesn't even move. Like, okay. Okay, so if I remember correctly, the third one comes from there. Now he moves. Is he hiding in there? <laughs> also, why is everything locked again? That's mean. Super mean. It's locked all right. Hi load somehow were you today? Also like what the fuck? They rang the alarm in a completely wrong place. Like they didn't see bodies or anything, they just decided to rang the alarm for the fun of it. So yeah, that's that's something also. 
Great Hogwarts legacy is today, not 100% yet, but yeah, the final boss was pretty awesome. <laughs> I am happy to hear if you have enjoyed it. I haven't still played it. Still not sure of a lie. Don't own the game yet. Can I like freaking shoot back? But no, everything and everyone is a fucking bullet bombs. Wait, yoinks, yoinks. Still, why is all of the chests forgot? Lost. I want to pick up things, but the game is like, mm, no extra loot for you. Mm. Oh my god, why did I put it back on? Oh well. Damn. How the fuck? I'm pretty sure it hit that one dude. Well, that didn't hit anyone. Stand on the fire, it's gonna do good for you. But no! They can stand on fire, I can stand on fire. Because I will die if I stand on fire, but they... They don't care. Um... The fuck are you doing? Stop it! That's weird. Very weird. Okay, so there would have been a sneaky way. Why would we do it that way? Is there game logic? Yes. Even saw me. Rude. So fucking rude. They just knew once again. Like sometimes, yeah, I, I have made mistakes and I can be easily seen, but sometimes it feels like they just know that you are there out of nowhere. Just. Mm. 
enemy must be over there. Did we see him? No, but we know that he is there. Why or how? Yes. I did not find a key. God damn. I haven't even seen the red key anywhere. Comrade Lesnitsky, the operation is progressing as planned. It will be completed within an hour. Well, the experiment has been successful. Her travels fast. Mm -hmm. Somebody gets knocked out. Maybe they are hive mind or something. Because that's the only thing that would explain it, like, how do they know always what is happening to other ones of them. See, that's what happens when I touch the fire, I burn! The enemies touch the fire, they are fine! You know, because fire doesn't burn everyone. I have mind and I have fire. Yes. And burn everything, didn't burn the asses. Tell me someone who isn't is like obviously a freaking pyromaniac. And that dude. Burn them and burn the asses. Like why why would you like what is the fucking point of burning to asses? That's fucking wasting to you. You Yes, that's why I call friendly fire, yes. Oh, come on! I hate it when the game does that. I don't know why it does it, but sometimes out of nowhere, if I press shift, and yes, I press only shift, and it still does it, even though you have to press the freaking shift tap thing to make that happen. But for some reason, sometimes some games do that, and it's fucking annoying. Okay, fuck you too. Gonna shoot your hands then. Get the fix for that. Keep it in pain. No, okay. We need doubt, that's why. I guess we are not going backwards anymore.
like, why would you burn bacon? Like, that's also weird. Why would you burn it? A skilly. Yes. Poor skilly. Why would I not do that? What the fuck? And our men. Suffocating will be a real shame. Getting shot into nose. First is to run away. Exactly. Agilis, how are you today? Because like how he lost his freaking uh, conscious saved like somebody punched him in the face. Unbelievable. I will tell the others about this. You know that a headshot is not but always fatal, but come on. Yeah, most likely you still won't be running away, you know? I'm not sure how I am today. Never suspected anything with an unknown deadly virus. And then their mop-up squads entered it under the pretense of saving the station from the epidemic and eliminated everyone they could. Women, children, old people. To prevent the infection from spreading. And if all this is true, then me and Anna could be yes, infected too. For no strip, yes. We've been and saved from being killed. Skulls, we don't get know as if we're going to survive for long. And could be okay. Um, what is your logic? Why is it exactly three? I have a feeling that everything will end soon. We won't survive this war, Artiana. No one will. I have three little I holes. Feel alone again. I don't still think like it's exactly how it works, Chief. My father was away on a mission. So Nothing the cocoa skin me. wouldn't break. Empty and cold. But then it would be like six holes overall, you know. From the fire, flying away and then You're very good and happy with yourself for improving and knowing it's more new characters and people around things, you. Enjoying your lungs. But I want to feel that, that I'm hmm. alive. Did you hear that? Sounds really good. Touch me. This is awkward once again. Hi Dream, how are you today? Your lipstick is astonishing. Oh, thank you. You good? Happy to hear. Not sure yet how I am today. Well, hmm, there seems to be nothing wrong with you. Congratulations, youngsters. You, Artyom, may go. While you, Anna, you have to stay some more. We need to finish Jeez, treating you. Thank talking. God. Well, what are you waiting for? Go! Go, Artyom. I'll find you. Come here, darling. Don't look there. What's that? Alright, where is the loot? As if looks like eight books. <laughs> loot? Stand here, it's dangerous. What the fuck? What the fuck? Who screamed in the background? Let me go, I'm helping! 
Yes, I know that. Perfect. Now, you take the temperature every hour. Blood samples every three hours. Blood samples every three hours. That sounds like a fucking nightmare. So, were you able to isolate the agent? You can't go in there. Yes! It's high danger zone. It is an Ebola virus. But trying to cultivate it is useless. It's basically non virulent now. Without the original I'm ghostly clown, how are you today? Please explain. Uh, I'm sorry, Gabriel. Here are the facts. For a moment I looked that he has a Phuket on his head, but no, I think it's a hat. In the third, it dropped to about 25%. Today, we only have two new infected. And they have a light infection, prospects of recovery looking promising. Now, as you understand, Lemuel never was a natural habitat for this virus. And in its wild form, it remains dangerous much longer. So, what does all this mean? The and missing as it is not a regular. Hopefully we get some proper rest eventually. Great strain, engineered to achieve maximum lethality within a short time, but then turn harmless. Damnation. It's definitely a pocket. Good, I'm not the only one who says it. Yikes. I only really missed the only one. Ah, uh, okay, that's actually more. Okay, that's fine then, because like, missing only one would suck. Missing multiple happens, but... You, yes, you. You can come through. Confirmed it earlier. Yes, but then you started to say weird things as well. Did I just stole from somebody's house? Probably. As if we would have never done that before in game. Move! Move! You can't stay here! Move, move, you can't stay here? Why not? Artyom, I'm here! I'm happy to know that you and Anna are alright. We can't afford Aww, to waste time you. being sick now. The dark one we're looking for could really be the last one. We can't lose him. Let's go. But I have to go. To lose the dark. I have to go back for her insulin. She'll die without it. Yo, boys, I'm here. I can't let you go. How can we buy anything when all we had is back there? And Hansa charged you so much. Please. Hansa gave you shelter. Stand back. Shelter to I die, you mean? Can I give you bullets? Can I give you bullets? Young man, you've seen what's happening here. They won't even let me go take the insulin. And I can't buy it. Everything we have is at home. Could you help me? Please. There you go. Thank you. The refugees sure were lucky, because Tomlin's rangers were here. Corbett's men All the stuff still there. Men we met with machine gun fire. Of course. What were you thinking? I was well, thinking Hansen could not protect the station. Sorry, that's forbidden without a permit. That's our man. Let this one through without a permit. No weak point. Ah! I want to waste my bullets. Take note of the funds Hansa expends on this quarantine. And they are generally quite reserved with their money. Perhaps they are aiming for an additional front card to use in negotiations at polls. Good luck in the tunnels, Ranger! 
open the door. It's kind of also reminds the game. In oh, some other time and place, both doors open what and life fall out. But there is no time but present, and no place but the metro for us. And we must do everything we can to save it. I have to hurry and catch up with the dark one. Anna has to tell This is in the Fallout universe now, it isn't. Pretty sure it is. This didn't the, uh, freaking fallout happen in the, like, like way, 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 way earlier? Like, was it 40s to 60s, somewhere in between that time? Maybe 30s? 20s? Like, uh, somewhere in between that time. Like, super, super, super early. Where this one is 2033? Unless a miracle happens. Come through! So if they are in the same universe, uh, well, then this one happened like hundred year, hundred years before. Can't fucking speak. But there is another way. Uh. We're leaving the station. Here's our plans. This shit just keeps breaking. All right. Are you going to police? No. Open the interline tunnel for me. But the interline is a dead end and very dangerous. That means you haven't dead listened. End? No way. That's our road to Polis. Open up. That seems so. Did you? Let's go. Careful with the generators. Careful with the generators. Okay, bulk the generators. Open, open, open. To list stations. all the symptoms of being on fire. Total meltdown came in 2077 alone. in the Fallout universe. There's a special place. Total meltdown. The few people who come upon it never return. Hmm. I call it the river. Uh, of how was it in Fallout 4? Because um, I remember that there was all the weird kind of things. Or is it just like alternate universe in that sense, like uh, the things? Fallout well, is 2287. Okay, yeah, it's just uh, like atmosphere and the songs and everything that like played on the background made me thought of that it had been like way earlier. Hey, hi, Skeleton, how are you today? Hi, Nipsum, how are you today? Woke up at 3 a.m. Oh, hopefully we get some time to rest properly eventually. The metro is a living, breathing thing, with a heartbeat, a soul, and a mind. We got to be careful here. Okay, so because I fucked up, we can't go backwards. Okay, well, let's hope there wasn't anything interesting. Yeah, they are all nuked around the 50s, mainly Fallout, hence the look. Okay, okay, yeah, because that's what I thought, that, that they have been, like, in, in that point of the time. It's an abandoned place. But this one was, like, um, way later on. Like, I guess everything was fine until, you know, 
certain point and then well everything turned slightly into bad yeah <laughs> slightly into bad direction so i would not Been personally say that they are in the same the universe We've got Soon, the leaders of Hansa, Redline, and Reich will meet in Polis, hoping to reach Why does it throw me this far? That's annoying. But yes, how is Skeleton? But I know the nature of man. Or did the garlic well can't handle sunlight? Has lots of War money. Compost lives in a castle, sleeps in a coffee, likes to read and drink from fancy glass. That's what came up to your mind. Has a lots of money. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm sorry. That is a proof that I'm not the one part. What is Pompose? We're leaving the station. Here's our pass. All right. Are you going to Polis? No. Lives in a castle. Mm, not sure about that one either. Sleeps in a coffin. I admit nothing. Dead end. No way. That's our road to Polis. Open up. Another success. Nice. Thank you for yeah, keeping my identity there. safe. Hesse, I proceed it. How are you today? The you sure there are poor one purse around? <laughs> discourage people from entering these passages. <laughs> My hats. An unprepared man could easily lose his way here, or even become lost within himself. But as long as you're with me, there is no danger. What is money anyways? Maybe the real one permanent was the blood we drink along the way. No, geez, no. They are not the same thing. Money is the thing that you have to, you know, pay for the place where you live. You buy food with it, you buy your clothing and such and such and such. Everything, you pay your therapy with it. And yes, like what more people say, like uh, money can't buy happiness. Well, I disagree. I really do disagree because maybe you can't buy the stuff called happiness, but you can pay for your therapy. You can pay food. You can buy gifts. You can buy nice things. You can buy video games. So do tell me how those things do not equal as happiness. So money can buy happiness. Hi Interitum, how are you today? Third being doing snow work since 9 a.m. basically. Did have an hour break, but still more to do. Oh, you boffing. <laughs> Hopefully you get some proper rest eventually as Remember, well. We must find the dark one. It is the only thing Those people have never been bankrupt. Mm-hmm. You get more things. Yeah, and more things as also like the financial stability. You don't need to fear when you will be able to eat the next time or that, you know, you don't need to fear that we'll lose the place to live and so on, so on. So I highly disagree with that statement. It's an abandoned place. I'm sure you can pay some of it with blood. It doesn't have magnesium and copper. You could probably craft coins from that. Somebody stop cheese. <laughs> Still feeling like shit, but yeah, got the acre. Money can literally buy happiness, but of course not in unlimited ways. But the core of happiness is guaranteed finance, unless you are a hippie who lives in a tent in a warm climate. Hmm. And once again, I wish I could hug you. I really hope that eventually things calm down and you'll feel at least more okay. I'm happy to see you around. Hear that? Even Get if that. I can imagine it's not exactly like it is to be possibly around with 
people. And he teleported. I can buy security and luck of it just sucks. Mm -hmm. hmm. Yep. Plus, uh, well, geez, I got to say, like, if you go to bank and you are like, here is some a random five liters of blood. Now, let me, or you go to the store. Okay, you got to buy food. You go to the store and show up in there with five liters bag of blood. I'm pretty sure no one is going to be like, hey, here is these items. And of course, this is a valid payment. Most likely they're going to, you know. Call the cops and the guards are gonna come after you and, you know, you're gonna get some issues and you're gonna be questioned Where the fuck did you get that five liters of blood? Like, no, jeez, I, I don't think that's a valid method of paying things. I really don't think so. Just some monsters, nothing else. Let's go. If you don't get the cops after you, it's the men in the white coats. Most likely both of them. Oh, you need to craft the coins first. It's like in games you don't start. Some things and the NPCs can do for you. All right. What if you donate There's the blood? Mm. Isn't it usually like, uh, at least in here, isn't it uh, like optional so Please. you don't have to? So you don't kind of get anything out of it. I don't know because I have never like given blood. And poorly attached. My blood. Already have it way too little. I don't think you get anything in here for it. Blood mm -hmm. would be the worst currency ever. It sounds like you would just generate unlimited amount of it. And if everything is paid in blood, how do you pay for blood transfusion? With the same blood they just gave you? Probably? Look, water. We're almost there. Look. Mother. Just like an egg till they decided your blood didn't taste nice enough. Oh, that's mean. Yeah, I, I can't get, uh, you know, because, uh, uh, was it three months or something? Uh, you have to be without donating blood after a tattoo, you know, so I, I can't ever donate blood because, you know, always got to get the tattoo after three months or something. Oh no, another tattoo! Oh no, can't donate blood! Hey, look, we just saved your life by pumping 1.5 liters of blood into you. But we need to harvest two liters now as a payment. Can't stay here for long. Is it the river of fate? Not so impressive, perhaps, on the surface. We have to enter the water. And the water is evil. Enter the water and imagine what you will change in your fate. Oh fuck. Hey Radix, how are you today? 
This invent is a drinking game. Every time you hear Artem drink, all of a sudden he looks stunning as always. Thank you. But uh, have I played drunk like only a few, few times in the game? Welcome in Raiders, welcome in, thank you for the raid. Hi Rod, how are you today? How was your stream? How are you playing? This and hi was Schiller Lock, how are you today? Always My bad if I cannot pronounce it correctly. I apologize. Queen. Yes, welcome yes, in, welcome in, how are you all? Hi Arshia, how are you? You doing good? Happy great stream. Hmm, happy to hear. It's always pleasant. Thank you. Red Dead to Redemption 2. One beautiful day. I'll I'll still play that one. One beautiful day. been doing Red Dead Redemption 2 on weekends. Nobody. I've been doing the remaster of Tomb Raider. Is this where we we almost got him? How is the remaster of you Tomb Raider? Do you like it? The Dark One. He's still at that freak shop on the train. No, after him, and he just fucking pushed me in there. Because this won't go wrong, you know? What they have done with the graphics is great. The addition to the environment as well, and you can switch to new or old graphics at any time. You chose tank controls, but there are modern controls option too. Okay, that sounds actually really good then. Because, uh, yeah, I'm not a fan of uh, tank controls, not at all. So the option to choose not to use it, it sounds actually quite a nice. Maybe I have to play it eventually as well. Yoinks? What are you? Huh? Would you walk a little bit faster? Oh, <gasps> skeleton! Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Remember everything I told you about the dark one. You must save him, and then he just might save us all. Oh my God! How they <clears throat> think it might save us. It can be turned off, but they also put an exclamation mark above an item in front of a switch to let you know Lara is able to interact. 
Oh, okay. I'd say that's a positive thing because, like, if you're one of the people who gets stuck really badly in games like that, yeah, that's definitely a positive thing. I'm thinking of, like, I think I have only played one, not one, maybe two or three Tomb Raider games, so not really too many. <laughs> Sadly, have missed a lot of them. When did I? I definitely didn't hit him, but sure, sure, all me, all me. So many of them playing you. I have been playing a lot of lot of lot of games. But like other games. Mostly. Hmm. How is that not a headshot? How is that not a headshot? Boop? It doesn't do anything to them. Like you shoot them in the head and they are just like, mm, it happens. So pretty much that was just wasting the bullets. Right, this real. Mm. Okay, that's fucking bullshit. Why do you have lights? Well, most likely probably for that reason that I won't be able to see what is going on. Sad noises. Who the fuck shot me in there? Um, um, did that break? Maybe. Most likely, yes. I hate those lights. I really do hate those lights. shooting games so you actually don't need to say anything what you're shooting you know just run in blind and hope to actually hit the target you know that's that's also great How are you today? Ah, oh, no, we are not late. <clears throat> no scripted. Nice. I hate that sound. Jeez. 
Jeez, no. Still no. Not bad, happy to hear. Of course, I could not kill him. And while I am alive and my heart is beating, I will protect him. Khan says we will be able to use him to Can stop check the war. Out. How many chapters this yes, one has? Yes, can make miracles happen. But I don't want Very to use one, him. including the interaction. His war was over when I targeted the missiles at his well, home. How the fuck am I supposed to know at what his point family. of the game you are? Uh, what was it? No, that's a wrong. Okay, I guess we have to move now. You have no status, baby. It's I amazing. You could borrow some money from them. That's story time. Mm. Take your time and good luck. Safe travels. <sighs> Hi, Rudgar. How are you today? supposed to do you're good happy to hear i'm not sure That's how nice. i am today dislike of the game is how come our moves is more by the game ah looking cool today queen thank you i would not recommend a game today Okay, 
fucking cookies. And here we go again with the bullshit enemies. Thank you very much. It's minus six over there. Hmm. I think the rats in New York will get like this. Hmm. Imagine how many rat burgers would you make out of those things. <laughs> Don't make rat burgers out of rats, please. That's mean. Many hungry ones here. Think your food. Poor rats. I made this major. Poor Dan is turned into burgers. Sometimes I wonder, geez, what the f is going on inside of your head? Like, after all, you are cheese. Why do you want to eat rats? Isn't it usually the other way around? Revenge, okay. Look, unlike you, with clothes. Yeah, only sometimes, like 99% of the time. I like this place, it's filled with skeletons. Can we sit in here? No, because he wants to party this game fucker. Except when you're hungry for rat burgers. And how often are you hungry for rat burgers? Like 99% of the time? Watch out. Good to say, cheese is the best company to have the Credit Kruger. And it's the reality. Freddy is not mentally prepared for the stuff he would see in cheese's dreams. Uh, 
just cheese open say he wants to eat strange things um yes though for some reason after all of the weird things he wants to eat he doesn't want to eat the mega cheese that is a delicacy into corsica <clears throat> so Everything else is okay, but for some reason that isn't, and I do not understand why. <coughs> Your house is so high. You made the city so huge. Why are the people down there? Why so few? Whatever my intentions you said, if we go there, you you'll take a bite, but you'll still go eat privately before. Just does not seem to care. What if you get caught about privately being you to somebody's like delicacy? Going after him. Isn't it planned as nowadays we since people have to go together, to live magazines like them and have started to eat them? Uh, no, I think it's still completely fine. Like, you're just not allowed to like um, sell it in specific places. But, like, uh, I think it's still completely fine in Corsica. Besides, it's a delicacy the same way as um, a fermented shark is in the island, and we have a. I guess. Mammy. <laughs> no, I would not say that it's a bad thing. Like, uh, but, like, I think them? it's okay because it's a delicacy. Them? Just do it about it for a second time. You don't Dangerous. want to eat my good cheese. Why not? Mammy, yes. Mammy is good. Exactly! Finally! Finally someone fucking agrees with me. Because I know so many people who hate Mammy. With passion. You're thinking of the maggots needing to put them in your mouth and you want to move it. I'm sure it's fine. Just fine and perfectly splendid. Mummy is what exactly? It's a wheat and rye pudding. It's a heavy flamer. We got heretics to burn. Hell yes. <clears throat> mm -hmm, that's not done. is made of pig's blood. Oh yeah, we have thing called rassu bottles, which is a uh, blood pudding soup. That sounds suspiciously vegan. Uh, tea sweet and dry pudding. <clears throat> I guess you could like it. And you could definitely eat it. Oh yeah, like we, we have our own version of Tiet, and yeah, it's uh, a fresh soup of it, which is blood pudding soup, and it does not look appetizing. I only had it once, you did not like it. We were forced to eat the fresh soup of it in school. Mummy with cream and sugar, 5 out of 5. I say, I like you way much more now. Like, yeah, you have always seemed too nice and cool, but damn, now I'm happy. Because, like, even though it's like one of our traditional foods, the people who actually do like mammy 
is very small. Philemon sent both loads of mummy to Africa. The mummy box looked so sus they thought it was a cruel joke. Oh no! <laughs> if getting burnt is the price to pay in order to not have to exist at the same time as mummy, then so be. <laughs> we'll have to try it sometime. Mm -hmm. But yeah, like be be notified. Like it does um, divide opinions very strongly, even in Finland. Like some people love it, some people like it, and then there are people absolutely fucking hate it. Like that's just like uh, that type of food just doesn't sound weird or disgusting to me at all. Like uh, if it's a delicacy in one country. Like, yeah, everyone has their differences. And usually, like, uh, uh, countries that have had some extreme... Is it famine? Or, like, uh, extreme issues with the uh, ability to eat in their history. Like, there has been proper hunger and all that. They usually have, like, used all of the parts of the animals. Tongue. Tails. Lot, everything, bones, like fucking everything that you could possibly get out of them. Just because, well, you don't have much to eat, so you got to use everything that you possibly can. The Scots like it, but then they do like deep fried Mars bar. Eh. People are different, and like, yes, I do hate. Uh, or blood pudding soup. I hate it with passion. It's disgusting. But I have tasted it. So I know I li don't like it. But I haven't tasted a lot of lot of lot of other countries uh, cuisines that we don't have. And I would like to try them. Because who knows. Maybe I'll like them. I just don't know it yet. Because I haven't tried it. And of course like. Yeah if there is somebody who happens to like like at them of course i wouldn't be there like ew that's fucking disgusting no because it's they like it and it's fine people like different things where the fuck are we supposed to go okay i hate you too so why are you not dying Lovely. Hi music man, how are you today? Um, I'm not sure how I am. You need to go sadly, we'll be back later. Safe travels on plane, hopefully we'll see you later again. Participate, it looks like it. Go for it. Because, like, how can you know you don't like it if you don't try it? Like, yeah, maybe the ingredients that go into it don't sound too appetizing for you. 
but like, how can you say you don't like it if you have never tried it? It's me. It's and plus, sometimes the foods that sound weird to you might be your new fast. favorite food. So who knows? I am working. You have to mute things for us again. Are we really talking about maggots still? No, we haven't been talking about maggots for a moment already. We've been talking about different countries' cuisines. Sometimes I see a door. Somebody calls for you from there. Why? So once again, you were the one who brought the maggots back into the convo. We are coming to Polis <coughs> together. Come, what may? You didn't want to talk about maggots, totally. Mm -hmm. not want to leave. Why you sound suspicious, cheese? I don't yet get why. It is time to yes. I'm glad it is, because he is helpful. You. That was suspicious. <clears throat> and I feel weird about it. Like, why did it, like, give us karma about walking into the... Grenade. That makes me feel very weird. Not in a good way. Also, yes, our gas mask got dirty, so we had to get a new one. Yeah, why does it do that? That's very suspicious to me. Like, why does it notify it? Maybe it's something like if we do not notice it and we'll walk on it, it will affect on how the dark one will see things. Somebody there. Hard to see from here. Uh, because Jesus is how we usually call him in the Discord and everything. And he has tendency to Friendly change his names that. multiple times, so he's cheese. Where's your identification? I'm not fucking around! It's all right, people. Stand down. He's a police ranger. <laughs> Going down the ring? Well, hurry up, then. They're all jumpy. Didn't even want to let us. Come here. Let me exchange some ammo for you. Come here, ranger. You Look, buy anything you want. All, all the stuff is the best, just the best. I should it myself. Hi, Ogorki, how are you today? Just tell me what you want. 
I've got it all. Good, happy to hear. Waiting for us. Eager to kill. Don't know where you're at. Mental beds and fireballs. Learn every inch of this place, like the back of your hand. Yes, coming together. Move out then. Nothing here either. Nobody here. The enemy sighted! Where? He disappeared! Look for him! We'll fail the mission if we don't find him! Enemy sighted. I think they shot a rat. Once again, like poor rats. This game is definitely not rat friendly. How are you? Uh, I'm not sure how I am today. Well, it did a skitter and leap in time, so it died. Oh. <clears throat> Poor dance. You have coffee, life is tolerable now. Nice. I'm happy to hear that. I saw you have these. Good? Now I know what for. I'll bring more. I hear. I help. Not always enough strength alone. What? Kulagin, take thinking and follow the path. We might still catch up with the caravan. Klimitsky, stay here. Yes, Conrad Lieutenant! Yes, sir! No, he's a dark one. They are different kind of species. the future of humanity.
Was here is something that I would have still picked up. Maybe. Hi John, how are you today? Sneaks and hugs and leaves. <laughs> That dude is just standing in there like, hmm. More war? We just made peace with the Nazis. It hasn't been even a year. You are, yes. How about yourself? Pretty much the same, I'd say. Pretty much the same. an achievement nice that high five we got this hell yeah oh i need to go the shovel path let's open snow is way steep good luck hopefully you'll manage to do it as fast as possible and thank you for the lurk as i appreciate it Bonk. It is. It is still snowing here. Just looked out the window and snowed last night. Not much snow. Hmm. Are you happy with it or is it like, oh no, fuck this shit? So you don't have to deal with it, you're indifferent to it. 
Do you get summer weather? Well, yes, it's not snowing always, but it's also not summer at the moment. But define what is a summer weather, because our summer weather might not be your summer weather. Makes you wonder why we have to stand guard. Looks like something important. All right, position taken. Perfect, Lesnitsky. Now it is your turn, Comrade Morozov. We must field test this virus that we have obtained at such risk. I think you had some uh, associates suitable for the task? Yes, Cheslav Andreevich, out of Venice. His bandits think I'm one of them, and if we pay them. Spare no me need details. to apologize, like, feel afraid to ask. Is your there is clear, nothing wrong about speech. asking. Yes, about Comrade it. General. No. Did you think we'd just let you go? We'll see about that. I have a trump card. You. You've been people on once and you was a child. Hmm. That's nice. Good use. <laughs> see to it then. And you will have to handle Red Square, Pavel. It's the most critical part, and there's no one else I can trust with it. You need Do to not go to shop, you need beer. Good luck. Safe travels. I won't, Comrade General. Went to visit sauna. Do you remember? Did you like it? Need to stop. Thank you for the lurk. I appreciate it. He is very bad. But you are right. Killing is worse. What is considered as winter for you? Like what type of temperatures are winter for you and what type of temperatures are summer for you? He who sows the wind shall reap the storm. The dark one opened up Lesnitsky's thoughts to me. I know all their plans. I know Pavel is going to be at the Red Square. And that's where I have to face him, before going to Polis. A peace conference is being held there. <laughs> Laughable. The war has already started. It won't stop For while there's a person alive in Metro. Five to five All trying to stop it could just as well try and stop a tornado with their bare sucks. hands. Uh, I'm I asking from everyone, to try. so everyone can answer. I have to reach Polis. To denounce Sometimes the I know there is a lot of people from different and countries and see summer and winter temperatures might be completely different. Like for example, compared to uh, what Shut John said, you. for me Don't winter you. would be like Don't uh, see me. Don't hear. Alive and dead at once. from anywhere between Very minus strange. 30 to minus 10 and plus 20 is uh, plus 15 everything is summer. Hi Mythic First, how are you today? <laughs> like uh, temperature voice, because like I don't know what do you mean by hot no, summer weather. Because for me everything above 20 plus is hell.
same. And I think number 20 is horrible. But your summers are usually 30 to 40 nowadays. Ugh. Yes, I prefer the cold weather. Like, in my opinion, it's minus 20 on it's like really nice. It's cozy weather. Minus 25 is also like cozy weather. Prefer it definitely. I want to experience minus 20 so bad. Like, if it's not windy, yeah, but pretty much no matter what kind of temperature it is, it ruins it if it's windy. Hi Reaper, how are you today? I have to say. It's okay. Excited. Uh, is there possibly a Cradle of Filth concert nearby you or other reasons? <laughs> now I'm interested. Like, mm? please do share. <laughs> Maybe. Mm? I don't like the heat waves you get at times. Uh, I said it in like a couple of hours. I'm jealous. I do hope that you enjoy the concert and have fun. Oh my god. Mayhaps. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, I do hope you really enjoy it. When my door is open in two hours, not long left. Soon, soon. I'm going to watch the film tonight. Hmm. Enjoy. Have you decided what film? Mm -hmm. You sure it's gonna be awesome? Same. Tomorrow is your turn, right? Yes. <clears throat> or it would be. It wasn't from one coffee. Uh, coffee complaints. Wait, what? Trying a new coffee today. It's called Dark Magic. So it also is something you had a hand in making. <laughs> I wish. That would be if it wasn't from one of the crappier coffee companies. Oh. So that's what it's called. Music. Not 
Or if you, you try. It's okay at best. It's a big bird, though. Yeah. That's sad. <clears throat> Looking forward to it, Strange. but they are making a lot of fun singers at the minute. I see shadows better. Bob Marley. About Bob Marley. Ah, okay. Well, do tell afterwards that you like it. I want coffee. Take your time. I want more Irish coffee. That's what I want. That's what I want. Irish coffee. But I think the specific type of brown sugar that I have is like not not good anymore for beasts of evil. Don't know about us. Hungry. I guess it's good if it gives younger audience to listen to these singers. We'll bring you some hell yes. How are you today? Woman. No idea who you're talking about. Why is it raining inside of me? What the fuck is that? Oh my god, now the game is doing this same shit again. Uh, and who says it's cheap? I might as well be he. No one knows. <coughs> Ooh, that looks actually very nice. How they completely ignored what I said. Mm, cookies, yes. <clears throat> the game is once again like moving team mice. Also, the other screen was just damn annoying. So I have to like click into it and change team. A little death for your enemies. Welcome back. trying to make itself more challenging for you. Hmm, it's trying. <clears throat> I guess. You want this? <sighs> Just that nah, these games are not scary. At least not in my opinion. Missiles. What do you can just walk around those big red monsters? Ah, uh, yeah, if you make sure that they don't actually see you. Yeah, you can. As in the first one, you can also shoot down the missile thingy. Like on the point. Like you have played this once, right? So in the first one. There is two endings as well. All of the other ones has also two endings, but the first one has also two endings. And to get the good ending in the first one, you need to shoot down the missile launcher. 
at the final moment, like when the countdown starts, you have to shoot down the missile launcher and you will get a good ending. Where the fuck he said there is a ladder? There. Let me murder every single one, one and their Watch next out. skin when you played it through. Oh. Well, now you know. Killed the demon as well. Felt a real bad after though. <laughs> yeah, uh, the thing is, like, I do remember that it has babies. So, like, once again, bad karma if you kill him. Off to continue with the snow work. Have a nice evening, all. <clears throat> Good luck. Hopefully, you manage to complete it first. <laughs> and hopefully, we'll see you later again. Bloop. It's less than broken. <clears throat> so I guess on a mean playthrough where we are gonna go with the murder route, then we'll have to uh, pick up all of the diaries because, well, I saw no point of like um, killing her this playthrough because, well. I haven't already gotten all of the diaries. Like, if I would have, then yeah. Because then we would get it. But now, like, it's just bad karma for no reason. Though there is one thing that I do need to get as a bad karma. I know only one way <clears throat> to pull this from Welcome here. back. Got a drop of whiskey in it for you. <laughs> Come get it. Nice, the thank you. The Order keeps an outpost in the St. Basil's Cathedral. I'll get in touch with our men and tell them all I know. And my goal would be just a step away from there. <laughs> it will all be over soon. There's danger here. Not like before. I feel it. And we'll be with you. We'll tell you what to do. And by drop you mean at least a cap's worth. You feel it. Finn, how are you today? Being busy. Hmm. Building 
tiny things. Oh. How is that cool? In this part, you can get 2.3 and white bean back here on Amazon. Admit to be kind of tempted to get it, even though it wouldn't fit in your apartment. <coughs> Go for it. Time to throw the bed out of the window. <coughs> and everything else. And just have the big bean back in there. Oh, you need to farm stuff. More stuff. Mm. Uh, did you play late with Nimi? <clears throat> Time to knock the hole in the wall then. Yes. You think. If you remember correctly, okay. Fair. Also got the treat for the gecko. You didn't need a lot of uh, ingredients or I will help you shall get one and name him or Aha! Do not disturb hmm. the Stay close to me. They've been here for so long. Lots of them. But they are all lonely. Only fear and pain. Hmm. They can't leave. And want somebody to stay with them. Where did the dark one go? Oh, he's there. Okay. Arty, <laughs> there are bad people. Many. Very bad. <laughs> Alright, let me check out. Was it really that I need an achievement for it? Is it? Is it like a hidden achievement then? I think it is. 
remove your mask when this new skitty mouse in. Oh, Pavel. You hated this area of the game. You think it took almost as many tries as the final. Opa! Area. One more! Put your weapon on the ground and hands behind your head! I will be doing this, Artyom! <laughs> well, your luck had to run out someday. You can disregard the order about the weapon, okay? Comrade, we have special orders directly from Comrade Corbus concerning this very ranger. We are to eliminate him. Fire! Fire at will! Don't stand. I will help. No more. Too tired. Carry out the order, Blin! I hate that light. <laughs> the light is annoying. We'll help you see. The red line. Do you know how to shoot, huh? Eh? You just have to escape, huh? Okay. And then come right here. You just your fucking head sometimes, that's you. Or what? Maybe you thought Corbus forgot all about you? Not on your lifetime, D'Artagnan. And neither did I. Pretty sure I didn't get to mall yet. You didn't like it that way. Didn't want to join us, huh? You'll just have to buy the fucking dust here. Well, that's This is getting tedious. Lovely. Finish him. Attack! Let's avenge our goal. Oh, I wish I would have more sniper ammo. Sad fucking noises. Sure, <laughs> Sparta! You decided to show up? <laughs> you got bolts, huh? That's for sure! Well, you don't talk that I shoot them. I like to think of shooting them as giving the new piercings in them. Or is this? You checking it out? Huh? No, of course. We're having helpless mutants, I know. Okay. Always shooting in the dingleberries. Why not? He said that I don't have balls, so I decided to make it equal and make sure he doesn't have them either. You know? Makes sense to you? Find it amusing. Oh, fair. He isn't red. No anger. Just sadness. I don't understand.
Oh, a knife, huh? Ah, uh, that's my boy. That's my boy. Давай, давай. No remorse. No reproach. Давай. The fuck is this? Uh, nothing to piece loose on me, huh? Oh, you are some here. Fur tip, don't set yourself on fire. You're gonna have a bad time. The test of Octavius Kaya was successful. The virus kills fast and goes inert fast. If we can get enough of it, clearing out the whole metro is possible. But we must capture D6 first. Thus, Comrade Morozov, you have only one chance to pull this off. The Order has good fighters, but there are too few of them to cover all the entry points. Our scouts have located a boldly descended entrance through Kremlin. While Miller's at the peace conference in Polis, he will be unable to command his men. That's when we strike. Yes, a week longer. I really and don't like that person. The dawn yes, sir. Of a new <laughs> age. I think I have always like left him there. You rescued him. The thing is, I need to kill him. To get the achievement. But how do we get it? Because I'm pretty sure I have left him there. <clears throat> Ah, oh, come on, so it throws me this far. You got balls, huh? That's for sure. Come on, Ranger, kill a name like you always do it, huh? Or you're a chicken? Okay, so it throws me super far if I decide to go on a murder route, okay. So, you're coming to finish the job or what? Come on, come up here. Come on, Artyom, come on. <coughs> yes. You are good. Very good. Come on. Come on, then. Finish the job. Still not? Did I not shoot him? <laughs> I think you have to leave him and then do something else, or maybe you kill him after you replace his mask filter. I don't think. I think the thing ends in there. Oh, it doesn't let me shoot him here. Let's try leaving him then. Can I skip in? I guess there is no skipping. The test of Octiabriskaya was successful. Weird, because there is other things that you can skip throughout the game, but apparently not these ones. If we can get enough of it, the whole metro is possible. But we must capture D6 first. Thus, Comrade Morozov, you have only one chance to pull this off. The order has gone then I have to also take the mask off when Nitsnitsky wants us to do so. Which is... Mm, I don't remember when that happened. And I have tried to pay attention to it, but I haven't noticed it. Might be because I don't remember who is who. And I don't listen to NPCs, so that's not a good combo to complete an achievement where you have to do exactly how NPC says. Because, you know, if you don't listen to me in the first place, how do you know that? And then when you don't remember who is who, 
<laughs> you also won't be like paying attention to them. Decide. You go. You help. Decide. You can't stay for long. How do we leave? We need to go. He did a lot of evil. But now the thing is, will we still be able to get we food and make most likely not? some time for the peace conference. There isn't going to be any peace. Just war. The last war. Now I know the answers to all the questions. Pavel's head proves to be a real treasury of Corbett's sinister plans. Boy. I think I have always done saved, probably even not the bad place. Something strange here. <laughs> Wait. So maybe it's like I never realized that I just don't need to do anything. Is how you get it? I have to see. I have to say bye. Okay. Two bullets. That's like a bad feeling. Why I can't run? What is this bullshit? There's a big evil boo boo. Oh, okay, so we can actually go in here. But I was confused if we could. Ah, of course. Wait! Because I thought that oh shit, it's once again like one of those where I have to have the key, but well, it's probably there where I have to have the key. Yep, no. And do I have any fucking idea where the fuck is the key? No, I don't think I have seen anything red for a while. Yeah, so it's just somewhere. And then you are supposed to figure it out, like. Whoop. Or maybe some monster ate it and we are supposed to know it. Okay. Here we go again. Why can't I swim? That's my question. Oh wait, I think it is this one. So in theory, it could be smart to go back. But I'm not sure if the game lets me go back. Or at least probably not that me. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so I need to take a longer round. Don't fucking mind me, I'm just dealing loot. Oh wow, it's... Am I sure this is the correct? Yeah, it's gonna suck big time if it turns out that it's not the correct one. <clears throat> Welcome back. I cannot take any of it. Yeah, great. 
Well, at least we can say we opened it. That's something. I would assume it is over there, <clears throat> but then once again it doesn't look like it. Okay, so what was the difference now? Why did we die this time but not any of the other times? Like, what was the difference? Ah, oh, come on! And it... Mm, okay. Yeah, I don't feel like it's worth it then. Because it draws us at the very beginning of the level. So, yeah, there is no point of going to T. But in all honesty, what was the difference? What was the fucking difference in it? Like, why is it sometimes we are completely fine when we go there? And then sometimes it's like, oh, you swam, okay, now you're gonna fucking die. Okay. What did we do differently? I don't know. is toxic probably did damage to you and the last one was too much maybe but we have been healing <clears throat> so i don't know but that would make sense yeah it's a radiation poisoning though yeah, fair Fuck is doing what? Come on, go away. Come on. I don't have proper guns for this. Like, I have pretty much, like, nothing left. So fighting with things feels fucking useless. <laughs> And then there is the boss fight. Shit. Uh, let's hope I heal. Otherwise, we're gonna get fucked over. Big boo boo, yes. Yikes. Can I pick up this one? Yikes.
are back. Vulnerable way. shower and get two games. Take your time, enjoy your shower. Thank you for the lurk. Getting ready for work. Take your time. Hopefully your work day is gonna go well. Like, what is the fucking point of fighting in it? It would be nicer to just run away from there. Yeah, please do not even joke about that kind of stuff on my chat. It's kind of like... Okay, so not anyone gets an idea that it's okay. I have played all of the Metro games before. Me uh, Metro Exodus is gonna be after this one. But yeah, we have played them all in multiple times. We're just currently making a replay through them. Uh, well, it depends and I like all of them. Like they all bring their own part to the game series, so. I really dislike this shit. It feels useless. Like you're fighting with the freaking bear that you are also not supposed to kill. So why isn't there an option to just run the fuck away? Would be way nicer. <clears throat> Plus I'm not sure like how is it good karma to leave it alive? Because at the moment like uh well yeah it will be alive but at the same time it's also not gonna be on its ranks so much that it would be able to defend its mini versions, so I'm not sure about that either. 
Because he already wounded it so bad that most likely the monsters are still gonna kill it and... It is. It really is. Especially because I don't have... Wait, so healing items spawn after a while? Okay, that works for me. I thought that it died. I guess not yet. Ah, oh, come on, still. Yeah, I'm gonna run out of ammo before it's gonna die. <sighs> Fucking hell. Hyper, how are you today? I'm stuck in the boss. Still. Oh my god. Yeah, I can't make it. Oh my goodness, this is fucking useless. All of my ammo is gone. Do I have like anything that I could possibly like put down? Attempting to catch up on things. Oh. Welcome back. Hopefully, it goes well. <laughs> <laughs> the 
this is definitely like one of those boss fights that do usually ruin the games for me. Like, this is fucking annoying. beginning from this point like yeah because I have wasted all of my ammo and all that so not exactly sure if it's uh okay so which one was the nicer one Hmm. Maybe this one, I don't remember. I hope that I picked up the correct one, because otherwise I wouldn't be fucking salty. I don't know. <coughs> Instantly, now where are you today? Artyom, over here! Thank God, you're in one you piece. A friend. Wait, is this Artyom? This kid shouldn't be out there without a gas mask. What the fuck? <sighs> ah, so it is, so it is. A child of the surface, a dark one. No, don't shoot him, Miller. Then get it away from me! No mask. I should have known. This one's green, but that one's yellow. Tell him I'm not a danger. It seems he is adapting well. Yes. <gasps> that will keep him alive. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate I it. Talk to him, Artyom. Colonel Miller, put your fear aside. This child is the future. You need only take its hand. My hands are full enough. I doubt this creature can help us. But you too. And go on without me, for I give into better judgment and rid the earth of it. Oof. Mm. How is this? Oh, oh, I, I can understand his thoughts. And I can hear yours, aren't you? Can you hear anyone's thought just by touching them? With Artyom, it's different. We can talk from afar. He was adopted long ago. <laughs> and now you they tell it? me I was adopted. The Dark Ones <laughs> changed you so that they could understand us. What's behind that door? Did you hear? They call you. I can hear. Open this. Wait. That looks like one of the sealed doors in D6. Yes, at the exhibition. It has a strong lock, too. We've yet to break it. What's there? My people. They're inside. Sleeping. Incredible. Look at this. They're hibernating. He is not alone. I must wake them up. It's time for them to leave. We are all going there now. We'll open the door if we can. There's death nearby. All it wasn't the cannibal. But I must wake No, them. I think the cannibal um, metro was different. Now listen. Help us and we'll help you. I will. What needs to be done? I must wake them. We'll have to improvise. Hey, hey. Wake up, you Damn, Miller. Damn. Can you open the gate where the garden's line ends at D6? Do you have the code? I have all the codes for D6, but I can't promise a thing. You'll have to. He 
will help us in police if you do. Take him along then, and brief me on the way. If I'm convinced that he'll help us, I'll open your door. Follow me. Follow me, he says, but everyone follows the dark one. He is not alone. He's not the last. I understand his excitement and his wish to immediately meet the others, to free them and wake them up. But he has agreed to wait a bit longer. First he's going to try and help us. If we make it to the conference, the Dark One will be able to open up the thoughts of Moskvin, or Corbut himself. Perhaps make them stop this madness. This is our last chance. Artyom, we already knew of Octobriska from Khan. And we did confront Moskvin on this. Yet he didn't even try to disprove it. He told that by sheer luck, their chemical defense squad was exercising nearby. And thus, despite some sacrifices, they were able to make this What can you say to that? Even I would have done the same. But Colonel, it was Lasnitsky, the agent who stole a virus container from D6 right before the outbreak. So what? There is not a single living witness besides Artyom. Who'd believe the order? We have the D6 now. What if it was us who released the virus? But the Reds tried to break through into Hans's territory. We could make Moscow. He was attacked by Wolverine. What can we yep. do? We are not an army. We've less than a hundred fighters. Yes, yes Moskvin did gear up for war, but after Polis suggested that we share the wealth inside D6, he might actually agree to peace. And we must do everything to have that agreement signed. Moskvin, what difference does he make? He's just a puppet in Corbett's hands. And while he's talking, Corbett's forces are encircling you. You'll seal this peace agreement with your blood. Sometimes it feels like what? you possess the darkness. You got a better idea? You brought this ape here. Why does that happen? It must indeed. How We're done with this. Let's go to the council hall. Follow me. Mm. The mission to report, Colonel. Some Denied. days definitely will be worse than others, but... Urgent dispatch to D6 security force commander. Go to highest alert. Instruct Korneyev to proceed with... Yeah. I... He knows on my good taste, I can say something when he... <clears throat> motivating to it and be like, oh, I don't worry, it's gonna get better, but like on my negative days, God, um, yeah. Please I... let this work out. Don't have word for it. Stand up! Artyom, mm -hmm. little one, it's your turn. Comrade Moscovin, you must support me on this. Or else, some inconvenient details might surface concerning your brother's death. <clears throat> I've overheard one conversation between your brother and his advisor about the threat you pose and ways to eliminate it. What's the hell? Threat? We're brothers! He thinks you feel bypassed 
cheated. He fears you will overthrow him. <laughs> He's totally mad. Totally. I'm going to give him an earful. Words alone will not avert his assassination plans. No, you must strike first. Maxim, brother. I'm so pleased that we finally made up. It was a fight over nothing. Let's have a drink. Sure, brother. Thank you. Silent treatment. What are you looking at me with those honest eyes for? I say have onion rings on it the was your table of what the earth are. Who wanted me dead? Corbett sold you out. And now he's got me by the balls. All because Evil of you. Sneeze. Evil Exactly. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, brother. There's no forgiveness for me. But even so... Like I gave something to brother. Yes. Yes. I did. I poisoned him. Mm. Corbett. I'm a fool. I thought he wanted to save me. And he just took the power. Took me by the throat. And he's storming the D6 now. And there's that virus! Just got onion rings on his desk. And he that falls mm -hmm. into Corbett's <laughs> hands. The end! But you are the leader! Order him! Call the troops back! Stall them at least! Buy some time to make a deal! What kind of... There's nothing more we can do here. Spineless. Hurry! Faster! To the platform! Damn them! To the platform! D6. Follow me! Yes, we will take a break in a bit, just not yet. <clears throat> so, if anyone remembers, it's just the final <clears throat> sheen or... It will be bad for everyone if you lose, and I have huh? to save them. My family. <clears throat> well, at least you are honest about it, good so I'd say it's good. He is gone. He the did last what battle, he at least it sounds like it. And now he is gone to meet his kin. I can't judge him for that. The remainders of humanity are finishing each other off in their final fight. It is not his war. I hope he was able to forgive us. Me. For what we did to his brothers and sisters. His mother and father. Well, it may be not helpful, but that's damn cool. And I'm pretty sure some people are, like, super happy about it. Existence of that thing. That's about you as well. <clears throat> I guess in theory we could try to 
just complete this one before taking the break. <laughs> I see loot! Let me go! Look at it, the loot is there! <laughs> Moskvin wasn't bullshitting this time. The Red Line's advancing on three sides. My brother's in arms. I am not a man for speeches, but here it is. You are the most dedicated. I'm most the man for speeches. Proceed to it's make a ten minute long speech. If you simply do the job you were trained to do, we'll win this battle. Sparta! To battle! Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> This was not a nice knife for I have to like load it one by one. So no one hel else kept it, like uh, they are not trying to pick up anyone else except me. That's always interesting. Well at least they are, I guess, repaying to the fact that uh, Artyom do that, Artyom go there, Artyom, Artyom, Artyom. So I guess that's repaying it, finally. the fucking game does it again come on i hate it when it does that my apologies for it like for some reason it just decides that the mouse is on the other screen and then it starts to move things in there and then i can't see the chat and yeah that's okay. how is that not good enough what?
Wait, now I know why is it not good enough. Yeah, I guess we have to do that. Oh, come on. Why you do this to me, game? I press shift and you do that. Why would you do it? We won. Um, no. Not yet. Well done. He's leaving his eyes open, I'm sure of it. Probably not the smartest thing to do. Two things with the sniper when they are super close by. Yeah, that that's a, that's a smart move, yes. Well, to be fair, there is an achievement of doing it that way, but I think they were supposed to be like 30 meters away or something, and I think they are not, not even close to that. Hey Nightmare, how are you today? Fuck out of my way, there is a dude with a fire a flamethrower. So you know, I need to get it and you guys need to get the fuck out of the way, cause you know otherwise it's gonna go badly wrong, you know? It's 1 a.m. Aww. Hopefully you get some good sleep then. I still haven't played Metro Exodus yourself. Hopefully you do play it. It's a good one as well. Hmm. Now that we've lost D6, our only option is to destroy it. By the fires of revolution. Miller's what like a that. pleasant surprise, <laughs> Colonel Miller. Or oh, what remains of you? Artyom, it is time. Then who might be sweet? The 
resourceful young man. Tell me, Archer, savior of the metro. Where are you going? Stop him! <laughs> We got a bad ending. <clears throat> I think. Don't be afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of now. I think. No, no, not the bad ending. Yeah, in this one, I think the good ending is the carnal one. The so first one, bad ending. Second one, good ending. On the metro episode, I'm not sure. Please you did again, so. Yeah, like we already have the achievement for a good and a bad ending. It, is, it was just the achievement run, pretty much. And that's how your papa defeated our enemies how are you today? and saved the metro. But how are you? You're not great. Oh, wish I could hug you. And hopefully your day gets better little by little. And of course, if you want to talk about it, feel free. If not, that's okay too. And remember, my DMs are always open. Isn't this game like 80 years old? <laughs> no, it is not. I hope. Actually, look up because I'm not sure. Last night, relax. Mm -hmm. When did it 
come out. 2013. 10 years? 11. So they're making new FPS Star Wars game. Oh dear. I have noticed that I'm not so... Like, I used to be super excited for the Star Wars games, and now I have just... I don't know. Because, uh... Yeah. It affects a lot, like, what has going on the Star Wars University, on the movie-wise, and then it affects on, like... How Jedi Fallen Survivor was a big, big, big disappointment, so I don't know. Nine years already, game still looks great. Mm -hmm. It does. Another game also making its way, but we are only. Yeah, I saw it too. I got super excited and then I saw it's we are only and I was like, oh. It's from the guys that made Jedi Survivor and other things. Also, it's about Mandalorian, not from the show they said, but yeah. Yeah. That's the, the, like, it's from the guys that made Jedi Survivor. Okay, they rent my hope, because, like, that game was shit. Like, it was shit. Do all respect and love, like, no, I just can't find anything good about it. Like, basically, it was trashing so many things about the all freaking Star Wars universe and how like okay so and now the lightsabers are freaking color changing lightsabers today I feel like Sif now the lightsaber is red today I feel like Jedi now the lightsaber is blue like it you know, ruined it and overall the game was a fucking broken mess multiple months before it was on a playable state so and then, on top of that, the story just was... Ugh, I, like, I don't have anything good to say about it. Like, I am happy if there were people who enjoyed it, because that means that it has worked for some people. But for me, it was something that I don't plan to play again. It just wasn't it. And honestly, like, for me, the thing that pisses me off was the thing that it was expensive game. Like, super fucking expensive game. And it came out... As broken mess. It was fucking unplayable for months. Which nowadays seems to be more common than, you know, anything else. But, like, it was so fucking expensive. And then you had to wait multiple months to be able to play it. Even with the lowest graphics, because... Like, no matter what my PC had eaten, it just didn't work. Because it was so fucking shittily optimized. <laughs> you would rather get sand in your eye for a year so late than see anything Star Wars related again yourself. Hmm. At least Alan Wake 2 was 60 years at launch and much better game. Yeah, like, of course, like the prices that are that high really make me uncomfortable because they are like, how the fuck I can pay for it? But like, when it's games that are that, like, okay, I am not happy. If it's the 5 euro game that doesn't work since the launch, of course I'm not happy. But it doesn't piss me off as much. Then I will be like, oh well, okay, fuck it. It wasn't that expensive. But when it's the freaking 60 to 75 or over, and then you have made a mistake and pre-ordered it because you were excited. And then you pay like, let's say, 100 euros for it. And then you have to wait half a year to be able to play the game. It's not worth it. It really isn't. And it makes me fucking salty. And it has happened like way too many games recently. Way too fucking many games. You never pre-order. For a good reason, like. Because sadly it seems like nowadays the game developers don't exactly deliver to you. Like uh, you don't get a game that is working. You get a shit show and you have to wait until it works. The trick is to wait two years and pick it up for two, five years. Hmm, it really seems like it. Especially not with the state of games nowadays. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, I'm, I'm sorry that I'm this like, uh, negative about it. It's just like... Something that really does bother me. Because it has been like this for a while. 
with multiple games. And it seems like it's not changing. Nobody is like doing anything about it. It's just more broken and broken, broken games incoming. I'm still waiting for Wolong to be fixed and it's a year from the launch. Also, Dead Space was broken. Kalista Protocol is still broken for me. The Jedi Fallen Survivor was broken. Uh, Elder Ring was also broken for me at the launch, but at least that has been fixed, so I guess that's a plus. But like, it seems that it is an ongoing thing. It's always the broken games. Like, yeah, so pre-order our game for 100 euros, get a broken mess that you won't be able to play until a year later, and then. So you play Cookie Clicker. I think it looked cool. Is it fun, or do you just have to click your mouse to at once? Don't start it. Don't play it. Honestly, like, if you get uh, addicted to that type of games, don't do it to yourself. It is one of those games where you have to click... But you can also make an idle build, and it is addictive as fuck. So if you're not willing to sacrifice your mental health and mice for it, don't don't do it. Don't do it. But it can be fun. I just have a bad habit of like getting really badly addicted to that type of games. It wasn't like that back in the old days, and no fucking DLCs. Mm -hmm. Yep. And now you need to get rid of some snow. Oh, welcome back, Sombalane, and good luck with the snow. Do it, do it. Not negative, it's your personal opinion and very valid. You're on your side too. But yes, we are supposed to take a small break, 10 to 15 minutes, even though I kind of sort of forgot it. But yes, small break, 10 to 15 minutes, and after that I will be back. And we'll start Metro Exodus. So time to fill up your popcorn cups and get something to drink. See you all in a bit.
and I am back. Now let's see. The game is most likely gonna break everyone's ears. So my deepest apologies, since it's the first time opening the game according to Windows. So I apologize if it's gonna be loud as fuck. Hopefully not. Hmm. Thank you, thank you. I want you to change the game to Exodus. Yes, please, if you possibly can. Mm. Auto save has been corrupted. Please use chapters, manual select. <laughs> sure. Well, that's lovely. This was the game that doesn't let me take the motion blur off. Well, that's fucking disgusting. Okay. Well, let's hope it works. Uh, it's not the enhanced edition, it's the regular version. So, not the Metro Exodus enhanced edition, it's just Metro Exodus. Do you own the DLCs too? Possibly. But the thing with the DLC is, is I'm not sure if we're gonna go for it. It depends on. <clears throat> of course not. Need to confuse the people. Sorry, you're joking. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I want over it for you. Save that out a little bit. New game plus. How many of them I have to take then? <clears throat> Welcome back. Okay, we'll learn now and go work. On I still the remember life for you. before <laughs> the war. Thank you for the work. I proceed it. <clears throat> and good luck. Please do I keep me updated. I remember that we used to be different. How was the game all along compared to my there, voice? Good, bad, horrible. We used to be the masters of the whole world. We built gigantic cities of glass and steel. 
We crossed the oceans at will. Cool. Thank you. And we also conquered the skies. There used to be seven billion of us. We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air. And I remember it. <clears throat> Welcome back. Looks cool. The slow motion. The seven billion were mm -hmm. wiped out by the last <clears throat> war. It does. I really like the beginning. Fifty thousand managed to survive underground, with the surface poisoned, burnt, and teeming with horrible monsters. One day, the radiation on the surface might subside, and our grandchildren or their grandchildren on your game? Yeah, we might be able to return there. At least that's what my brothers in arms from the, the order break. believe. Basically, there was no hope for us right off the start. Still, we humans are just too bad at surrendering. We tried to make the best of what we had, banded together, and worked to make the metro our new home. After all, it might well be the only place left on Earth for humans to live. For a time, we thought we could make it. <laughs> but, regrettably, the war didn't kill our bad habits. The phone is dead dead. What the fuck? Like it doesn't... Even with the charging doesn't work anymore? In the relative safety of the tunnels, corruption festered. And when danger came from above the ground, only a few of us stood against it. Our number is dwindling by the day. You don't know. It doesn't look like it's charging. Weird. <clears throat> yeah, I hope it's the cable that is damaged. But I remember we were born for a better life. <coughs> I can't sucks. accept that I'm destined to grow old and die underground. I don't care if I'm called an idiot. Luck. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Between endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. I must find that signal. To be fair, this could also be the beginning of a zombie apocalypse. Movie. There was a slight feeling that zombies wouldn't probably survive in this type of weather, but you know, they also start quite similar, at least some of them. <laughs> We are super damn strong if we manage to like frozen things just boop! It's open now.
что вы сейчас слушаете этот текст, говорит о том, что наша игра вас заинтересовала настолько, чтобы начать ее заново. Значит, и я это аспект вашего лукса, Now, this game, notice is that I have a chance to see a screenplay resolution works, and automatically we're like, okay. Wait, so this was only... Okay, so those were the things that I added into it. Like, uh, we can now <coughs> listen all of those and we get like uh, developer comments about the game. It was a cable. Hell yes. That is really fucking good news. Okay. Like, yeah, of course it sucks that it was the cable, but that's still like damn nice. Are there any DLCs you enjoyed, Queen? In this game? I don't remember if I like played them. I really don't. But to be fair, like uh, between this playthrough and the last time we have played this game is two years and probably like over 200 games. So I don't exactly remember. <clears throat> and I don't really remember in other games too, like uh, DLCs necessarily. Welcome back, Hesse. Because, like, yeah, we play roughly over 100 games per year, so... There is quite a few! Okay, so that has that issue as well. It opens that. <clears throat> Two years. My, my, the time flies. Yeah. Like, the last time we played the Metro Exodus, I think it was two years ago. I could be wrong about it, though. That sounded like either spiders or dance. <clears throat> or maybe it was spider dance. That could be too. How in this one, I think more of them have turned into like proper skeletons. Like they, uh, in the earlier ones, at least some part of it, it's still like they have their flesh on, and you know, they are not completely turned into skeletons. But in this one, like a lot of them have already like been out for so long, they actually have turned into skeletons, and that is very pleasant to me. Yes, I know how morbid and uh, that probably sounds for some people, but. I do genuinely like skeletons. Like, they are things that make me happy. And I'm not expecting everyone else to react the same way. Like, I'm that person who sees a skeleton, <clears throat> no matter where is it, and I'm gonna be like, oh, skeleton! And <clears throat> I also have one friend who is like, ah, what the fuck? So, you know. Fucking hell, that reminded me of the uh, comic uh, that somebody once mentioned to me, like, um, that apparently people, when they see their crush or, you know, 
somebody who they love, I guess. And every time when they talk they're, uh, to them, like they're... Um, was it like, mostly like girls do it. Like if their uh, voice gets high-pitched, it means that they have a crush on it. It's like, dear lord. Because usually it doesn't like uh, affect, don't change the way I, I talk to people. It Of course it used to be different like when I started talking English at the beginning, because like... Yeah, it was not my native language. It still isn't my native language, but I also wasn't not even close to fluent with it. So it affected on like I would speak it with way higher note. Because <clears throat> I wasn't comfortable with it. Usually people sound like Batman. Yes. Cool. <clears throat> they are peaceful, in a sense, if you even understand what they mean. They are peaceful. And like, <coughs> the thing that Kinda, sorta. It's the same for us all, no matter who we are, where we are from, what are like. Everyone has a freaking skeleton. Everyone. So it's the same for us all. The same way as I see, like, uh, because some people see death as evil, some see it as good. But I personally see it neutral. It doesn't choose. It is the same for all. So if you make a sound like you <laughs> squeeze together, you're in love. Uh, apparently, yeah. Uh, according to that comic. Thank you for the hug. I appreciate it. <clears throat> so, like, I guess I get uh, have to get some, like, uh, voice modification and turn it into because like um back in the time when i used to still wave every time when somebody was like oh you are a pretty woman or something i would take a hint of the wave because it lowers the voice if you try to talk while you have it still in your lungs i guess i don't know how to explain it but it lowers your voice so i would always say like or am i and people would get confused and some even very uncomfortable or annoyed about it Hey, Demir, do you think the colonel knows what Artyom been up to here? How am I supposed to know? Ask him yourself. You forget sometimes that you pull up a music video or something and boom, song starts and you jump. Oh! Let him learn to stand up for himself. How else can he hope to survive in the metro? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You're gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now. Wait, so, so far we have it's gotten okay. all of the, the endings that are not lying. canon, I just realized. Because on the first um, game we got are the good ending, which is not worry? canon. Second game we got what the bad ending, which is not canon. So surface. I guess now we have to go to the not There's canon no ending as well. <laughs> no one to find, so which no is the non-canon ending? If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? Hell yeah. talked about this again and again. The game is like, do it you this way, and I'm like, it. no! There's only us. Colonel. Hello, Alex. There is only us. And your father is coming to talk with us. Mm -hmm. stubborn fool. You'll How find it without us we helping. Mm. Well, I have I achievements for... I think good and bad and both of yours. them already. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6, but you leave. People need you, and you pursue your selfish obsession. He has gotten but way older this throughout the three stop. games. There's he has gotten way grayer. Nothing else. And the order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? Well, at least he has the same voice actor as he had in the second one as You well. look fine to me. So, get ready to go. 
And I guess now he doesn't treat we'll me as like a nice person anymore because earlier he used to be like, no, Artyom, I love you, little Artyom. But I guess at the point when we married I'll his daughter, now he's Artyom, like, I'm gonna please, murder you. Promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Or something. Because he does sound like it. Artyom. We managed to bring but I guess those kind of things do change. People are giving you their blood. Like everyone is fine so with you, then you keep bringing it back you unless way. like. Uh, Don't yeah. you think that is unfair? Kind of. Yeah, Let me yeah, put it this I way. Assume the same I can promise I'll be able to bring it back well, next like, time. He was okay with my friends when I was younger, but immediately if I dated one of them, it was like a bad thing, and he hated them so. I see. I see. There it is again. Bloop. Moscow chapter of the story didn't always play out the way it does now. At the initial stages it followed something, something, something. I need to read it earlier, I dig it. Welcome back, music man. Nah, no, it's too much to read. <laughs> no, well. You've returned, and you're about to do the DLC for Bioshock Infinite. Mm. Enjoy. And welcome back. Metro 2034. I kinda want the books, like, even though. Something up there mm. could help us. Quite a few people said that the uh, sure games are not exactly the same as like the this. books were, like the people who actually read and that the uh, books are more of a, not as much shooting and jumping outside, but still like I am interested in reading them. Oh, I can't believe my eyes! Artyom, you're alright! You gave us a scare brother! Artyom! How are you, friend? I see you, right. gentlemen. Give this way. calls for a celebration. I do miss an achievement. I need to make sure all of them will stay in our crew. So I wonder how hard that one is to get. Because I think the. Who was it? Maybe Sam and. Who the fuck is it? One. Not two. Oh, uh, Damir, yeah. Sam and Damir are probably the only ones who have stayed on my crew at the end of it. So I'm wondering, like, how do we make sure that they will stay with us? Because then we could get that ending, because that is one of the ones that I am missing. More of nothing? Artyom, the only thing I can hear is that Geiger counter ticking. Also, how does the radiation work? Like, wild uh, question, yes. how does radiation and work? Also those damn things. Like, uh, is it okay if it gets in contact with your home, skin? Dear, because that is what I have been wondering, like, they have their hair free, they have their I'd face free, they just don't breathe it, but basically, like, the they might be there, like, not wearing clothes and all, so I'm wondering, world. like, silent, Artyom, does it not affect? It's time to go once again, you enjoy the astonishing stream with an amazing often, see everyone. Thank you for stopping by, Wagon is appreciated, have a lovely rest of your we day, and hopefully we'll see you on Monday again. Replace your filter. Haven't you spent enough time in the sick bay? Not in real life. It will affect you if you have bare skin, pretty bad. All right, because that's let's get how I have always understood it. Because you know, every time when you see documents or something, Twice, movies about radiation, it's usually people with the space suits, pretty much. 
like they look like fucking spacesuits, like the Radeon uh, Hazard so suits or something. Like it, you have to be very careful with it. But then so in this one, it seems like well, it's just a thing. Don't breathe it. Mm, it's not a big deal because you can, you know, and, uh, have your bare skin touch the radiation, radiated stuff. So that's why it confuses me. It depends on the type of the radiation. Okay. Uh, can you possibly explain, like, uh, then what type of radiation doesn't affect on you? Uh, like, like basically, what type of radiation this game would have? Yes, I am interested of this, so I ask. Because hmm. it confuses me. And then there is a shit ton of games where, like, if you go to the radiated area without the has a hazmat suit, we'll move to you're gonna die Dad and all that. Arrange all that radiation doesn't penetrate skin. Because if not us, then who? Come from? A flat with a kitchen. It's just a random infected a area, but ultimately it will make you sick. Let's go in turns here. It's not stable enough. Careful. At least it held. Does it not say what the radiation is at some point? Uh, I'm not sure. It might have said, but I haven't actually paid attention that much. Hear that? <clears throat> or at least, like, I don't remember it. I don't think it ever said. Okay, so then it's just not me not paying attention. It's also like not actually saying it. <clears throat> Because if you don't remember it, then they most likely haven't said it. Yeah. <coughs> Are you alright? Probably going to have some time to move and decide to end the show. This is something smart. Radon infected. Are you about to hold my Right, ready. Radon is the radiation you can have in your house. Because built on soil that contains a lot of radon. But where does that come from? This is why nobody should ever tell me that it's okay to ask questions, because then I will. The release of radiation is a phenomenon unique to nuclear explosion. There are several kinds of radiation emitted. These types of include gamma, neutron and ionizing radiation and are emitted not only at the time of detonation, initial radiation, but also for long periods of time afterwards, residual radiation. Okay. According to the wiki, it was a cobalt bomb that hit Metro. Okay. Copal does only remind me of that creature in, I think it's uh, Orcs Must Die, the Cobalts, the small creatures that are a little bit bigger than rats and they run fast and they are annoying. Rough product is not healthy, but it's really not good. So dangerous in making this stuff. <laughs> But yeah, thank you for answering. I do appreciate it, because... I really don't get why this zone is off limits to stalkers. It's nice to get answers, and it's nice to not get called idiots when I don't know exactly everything. Like in Chernobyl, it's okay to walk around some areas for a period of time, but it's a big no-no to that stuff. Okay. Yeah, like how do the monsters survive if that's badly 
radiated. It can't be that bad at this point in the storyline. <coughs> yeah. Unless if they are like radiated monsters and they emit radiation, I don't fucking know. I haven't exactly like understood that part, like uh, where did the monsters came from and what caused them and because <clears throat> weren't there this one guy who was talking about it that some of them have been possibly like uh, uh, mutated versions for from some of the animals? Incredible is quite an area like nature has taken over its place. I wanted to see. If you remember correctly, this is about 20 years after the war, so it's probably similar area to Chernobyl. Okay. Most likely radioactive dust has already settled down and blown away with the wind. Uh, where does it go if it's blown away with the wind? Like, uh, doesn't it just spread it, in a theory? Or is it just like uh, turning into smaller... And somewhere else, of course. Yeah, because that's the, I'm wondering, like, if it... Wind goes, uh, makes it go away. Isn't it then somewhere else, or does it like spread among so big area that it isn't as badly radiated? Or that's why they must use filters outside since dust is still in the air. Ah! Look, it's our guys from the order. Looks like they're chasing that train too. Let's join them. It's just dust, but only deadly at certain dizzy levels. Okay. This is to see it, but it will spread. That's our guys. They are trying to catch the train too. Also, I guess it wasn't. You should have checked first. Assholes. All we had to do was follow the damn train, CJ. Not the order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one. Hi, Sean. How are you today? Of yours, anyways. Of yours. You're putting this like you're not from here. We are. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. This is like I told you so. <laughs> you could you have been busy playing Tomb Raider one, two, three remastered. How have you liked them so far? And happy to hear you're doing good. <laughs> hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back. School game spring back memories when you had your PS1. Would you recommend uh, them for this to play as well? I have no idea how much it is at the moment in here. I was about to get a warm drink, but your lap got invaded by purring devil. Well, I guess no drinks for you. Guess you stay there forever. 
You can use tank controls or modern controls. Your choice, but for you it plays better with tank controls. Fair. Yeah, if healing would be done by, you know, poking the freaking uh, needles on you, yeah. Good luck with that, I would never be healed again. You stay in this chair forever and turn into beautiful happy skeleton. Yes. I'm pretty sure if something is that rusty, those ends would most likely crumble with our touch. Most likely. It is time to hydrate. Do I in all seriousness, does anyone know what do we need to do to get all of the team members to stay in our group? Attention! The turntable is switching on! Listen, if you come out of here, we won't accept this shit again. Okay? So she has been oh, screaming. Right. The dude who cannot speak. I'll help. Finally, I'll be of some use. Okay, they took the girl to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. Mm -hmm. 
gonna play games now enjoy your games Quietly. Smack the living shit out of the enemy. Gotcha. Violently. Very loudly. Garbage. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. Well done. He caused why it got shot. But he is the one who broke it. Do you hear that, Artyom? You were right all along. Do you see? It's not just Russia out there, it's the whole world. Oh my god. What for? Because the war is still going on, and you behave like fucking kids! Hello! All the guards will be here soon. Damn! No! Don't shoot! Not you? with him! With you! You have to run! Is this yours? They just left it sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Guards! 
You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Take the red door. Let's go. Gotcha. Who are you? Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Uh, hey guys, be careful. Artun, I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Artyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. That is a kind of interesting don't mechanic that it tells you if you are visible or not. But honestly, like, I haven't managed to use it even once, so... Okay, so this game also does it, even though like this game is not breaking to the game itself, but for some reason it still changes the location of the mouse to the second screen and that causes issues. Oh my god, thought that he jumped down for a moment. Close the lights. Ah, 
Wait, was there a... No, there isn't a Korean tape recorder here. Because I was like, wait a minute, was there a tape recorder here? But I guess it's more of a beginning of the chapter, maybe? What the hell is this? <sighs> Gotta tell me. Group D, continue patrolling. Bonk. Bonk. Group A, they check the courtyard and generator room. Communications were lost there. Damn, how many guards does it have? Bonk. They just had to attack now, these fuckers. Now I'm gonna. I don't exactly feel where the fuck I'm supposed to go now, but. Maybe I'll find a way, maybe. Group D, redeploy to the wind turbine zone. What that suits car and audition. When I hear? Sure. Current situation. Yeah. Am I glad to see you here? You yeah, haven't used this one before. Mm -hmm. Are you alright? I'm fine, thank you. Alright. Rooms are red, while it's are blue. I'm stuck on the eastern front. I'll go to the engine. Front. I'm it so should be ready now. Fucking you. <laughs> you go up there and Come switch on, the yeah. turntable mechanism on. You are right, it doesn't. Does it not do enough damage? I don't think the medic can help you anymore. Also, it's annoying when you get used to it that automatically when you shoot your all the rounds and the other games had it that automatically it will refill it and this one doesn't. It's like, damn it, why there is no, why does it not? you like not push me around the box eh? Okay, and now I'm dead. Great. Anyways, quick load. Come on, our 
Also, wasn't it supposed to be that I have all my guns uh, from the last playthrough? But for some reason, it seems like it did not give them to me. Okay, lovely. I hate them lights. Like, why do they have lights? Well, probably for that exact reason, so I can see them, but still. I hate them. Don't let go, Artyom. Immediately, let's go. That was intense. Are you okay? Hey, there's a manual drive on the platform. It's hard to Artyom. Fucking hell. Why do all of these games seem to have some epic problem? Let's do like, this uh, all of them have the problem that if you press shift, sometimes it counts it as shift tab. And all of them have the issue that your mouse just goes with all the screen out of nowhere. Yes. Randomly. For. Why are they hiding the fact that Moscow didn't survive alone? There, in the ravine, there are people from other cities dead. All of them. Still, why is that one dude called idiot? Poor thing. Gramps, what's going on out there? Down this road. The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste, though. They called the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to it's not my this call, and you misunderstanding know. as well, a general. I'll fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The order leaves no one behind. 
All right, Spartans. Throw these overboard and full steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch some air. Throw these to the board. Uh -huh. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! To you, to me, to everyone, the whole fucking world, and not even batting an eye. Uh? This is the one metro game you have yet to play. Hopefully, you get around to play it. It's a really good one, like all of them. Time and money, not uh, fair. That was just a warning. If you do not comply, we will shoot the kill. Fuck me, that's a What if that would have killed us? Then it would have been like, uh, oops. How is this his fault? You knew everything and then. Alorisha never gets injured, but he did get injured already at this point. Like as usual. Like it's always me. Artyom, do that. Artyom, do this. Artyom, it's your fault. Somebody volunteers. Well, no. Mm -mm, we can have that. Artyom goes. understand like why do you get good karma out of this like in here why you should go with the sneaky way because like you're gonna fucking explode the freaking whole thing so what is the fucking point of like trying to not murder anyone in here that doesn't make any sense to me Like, I still don't understand the one and the other one. Like, 
why you have to shoot the rats to get the freaking blushy. That you get good karma for saving the blush heat, but you don't get bad karma for shooting the poor rats. It just doesn't seem right. Save the rats, burn the blushes. But yeah, you get to bad karma for it because you didn't help the kid. First we go in a sneaky peeky like, and then we blow up the whole thing, and then we sneaky peek back, and nobody saw a thing. Yeah, and then they go kaboom, and suddenly we didn't do anything wrong, and it wasn't bad karma, even though they all died. I guess a lot of people still consider them the vermin. Yeah, but they are living creatures. So how is it not bad karma? <coughs> like this, the same way as like... We get bad karma if we kill them, but we would press the button and kill them all together, and that is not bad karma. Stop hugging. Fuck's sake, personal space. You like rats? Mm. If nobody saw us, nobody is alive until they saw us. Did we do it? Question. We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green. As if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to mind. what to do next. Well, that's the thing. They can't I, say the same. I'm just waiting it, for answers. It's not just a human mind. And hoping like. the commander... Who and until recently I trusted him implicitly because for example is going to if it be extremely be, persuasive and then of course I would think reasoning. the same way but I do not there is a shit ton of different opinions so we are at a crossroads so to speak where everybody can help but wonder what next? Where do we go from Still here? Still deporting. Why is he called idiot? Yes, more or less what I expected from you. Well, you the opinions are just opinions. It doesn't make them necessary bullshit. Like people Double just checked. happen to have their own. Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. And opinions are just so opinions. Like they don't necessarily they the truth. Who was have facts the behind them. And also, like, what goes to them, like, there might be a multiple different reasons why the person has that certain opinion. It might be the facts that they know is why it is. Because the stuff that they have been taught or the things that they have researched. It's not that simple to always, like, find the correct thing. Especially because there is, like, shit ton of information, for example, in the internet. And it leads to you. To find the correct the ones. Only viable course of action to play dead. To ensure radio silence. This but even with the certain amount of like a network of radio research, it doesn't mean that you are hundred percent correct. It just means that, so that you are relying possibly on the research that you have done. More bombs down on our heads by and then of course like with years forward we will learn once again more things and for example things that used to be facts back in the time and uh, years thick and so on have uh, some of them already proven that they were not real that they weren't facts under a street you talk you die policy and then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station sir with all due respect if we can't go back Maybe we should advance and move on? But the thing is, people are allowed to have opinions. Artyom, you don't need to necessarily tell them, hey, you are wrong. Because it's opinion. Check the airwaves. And then there is a difference of, like, so even if try. the person would have Look a completely opposite the side of the up. opinion as you can talk about it. Welcome in Raiders, welcome in. And thank you for the raid, I proceeded, hijack cross, Sakura, gamer lover, Mikey, the medium, 
Tico, no way back now. how are you all today? Which means how was your stream? We have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The uh, it's good at that. Have okay, you ever thank heard you, of Storm. The invisible watchers. Good to see you too. How are you today? How was your stream? Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned no, the army. No What's that all no about? That's good. A little laggy, like but all in good You'll fun. figure everything hmm. out. Otherwise, I am happy to hear that. To talk about. Do you think finding that ark of yours Resident is going to Evil fix everything? I do not. But if you have How a are you liking idea, it other than the lags? Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow, like Artyom always wanted. Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea. I say, we solve our problems before moving on to saving all Moscow. All right? How is it going, Artyom? Found it yet? There's a whole world out here! But a yes, world where we could live! live. Still thank you for the raid. So far, we only it. know Hopefully one thing for sure. Are as good Radiation as levels are nominal. The air is breathable. Loving it, you handled the dollhouse, so and I'm moving on to the reservoir. Okay, so, sounds good. How did you like the dollhouse? Because I do know, know a lot of people who are very extremely afraid of that one. I don't know that either. Where for me it was just what like, okay. So Moscow. wondering, like, how did you like Again, it? I don't know. Keep looking, Artyom. It's got to be a signal. But we do know we've been lied to. For 20 years we've been lied to. We know they've been killing people. Collateral damage is inevitable in operations of such scale and secrecy. You're fine with it, you know? Yes, people have died. Like not having you with us. Ah, oh, fair. Yeah, especially because you used a lot of time and effort to collect all of them and then they take away from them, from you, so it's like, oh, come on. This is such a great game. It is indeed. I do like all of the Metro games. This is maybe third or fourth playthrough, I'm not sure anymore at the point. Because <laughs> with all of the games, they like you use a lot of time and effort to collect weapons and then the game is like... No, you don't need them for this part. And it's so f***ing infuriating. Need to go feed your kids, but you'll be lurking. Thank you for the lurk, I appreciate it. And thank you for the raid as well. Hopefully you have a lovely rest of your day, and hopefully we'll see you later again. Good luck. I wouldn't hesitate for a second. I'm prepared to do anything to ensure Metro survives. Even though they shoot me on sight if I return now, it doesn't matter. Too many lives are at stake. Too many lives have already been sacrificed. I'm sorry. I didn't want to. I mean, but we have to make up our minds. How will things finish for all of us if we start out lying to each other and arguing? Wait a moment, what was that? Everyone who can hear me, everyone still loyal to the gods. Listen, everyone. So it is somewhere around here, the Yamantar Mountain. So the route from here should go there. Like this. So is this what you have to do? Like how do we get to a team and keeping all of the teammates? Stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. Everything will change. Everything. Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world. By the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for... Hmm. Bring it out, Demir. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir, 
Why do they do been go on? About in your I don't want to like. Do you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. Oh, <laughs> <gasps> skeletons! Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. It's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the you very least. You can't kill yeah? any cultists. It's about time. So okay, to knock them off. Because I'm trying to understand, like, how do we get to everyone survives until the end? Because I think I have only failed one, and I have the achievement for the good ending. I think. Sounds okay, I'm insane. but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's this side. Does it say it anywhere? No, uh, doesn't seem like let's it. Drink to yeah. the Why does it not say? Meep, meep. <sighs> I hope that was coffee. Hey, Artyom, at least the color of it was coffee. Map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. <laughs> Could have beer whiskey yeah. as well, but coffee. Full steam ahead. Hi. Full steam ahead. <laughs> wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? But then also, like, there was an achievement for the Alyosha never gets hit. Alyosha doesn't get wounded. But he got wounded at the very beginning, on the place where I couldn't do anything. And I haven't done anything bad yet. So that's why I'm also confused, like, how we would have been able to stop him from getting wounded on that sense. Because I haven't done anything evil. Uh, Damir stays with the crew. That one I need to find out. I don't know how do we get it. Duke and Damir stay with the crew. Alyssa doesn't get wounded. So have we already fucked up that part because Alyssa did get wounded? Or is that the wound? Or is it later on? I don't know. I'm confused. Very confused. I don't remember, like, does he get wounded later on in the game, or is that the first one where he does? So, dear Moses, can you feel how sweet the air is without a mask? Not just sweet, so many shades of taste it has. A weird feeling, I'm a friend. I remember you telling me how you took your mask off and in the dark. When you honed those missiles in on the dark ones. Was the air bitter then? Who knows though? Had you not launched those missiles, you'd probably never have climbed that building or received that signal. Life is weird. Huh? Mountain. One random event <laughs> drags another with it, like links in a chain. Happy. And oh. you are pulling that chain out of a deep, dark well. The links emerge from the dark water. And what drink is in that bucket that's on the end of the chain? That's a mystery. That's what I often think about when facing a choice. You can't drop the chain either. You always have to drink from that bucket. Well, bottoms up, I suppose. So, how does it feel to be the Moses who yanked on this particular chain? <laughs> Is it dumb to think about such things when all I ever did in life was carry out orders? Well, I'm not called idiot for nothing. Still. I would like to know Why is he called for it? Chain. He talks about quite a philosophical things. Look, if there's no radiation, that means we can bring everyone out of Moscow. It doesn't matter if there's radiation or not, Comrade American. The citizens of Moscow will have to stay put. But why? We're just a short way from the city. The radiation's gone. Things might have been that easy in your America, but life has never been so easy here. Even now, we woke up saviors of the metro, and by lunchtime, we're enemy spies, saboteurs, tra train thieves, and what for? 
Something we thought was true turned out to be a lie. And that is enough for them to want us dead. The Hansa bosses must have known that we could live up here. But the public didn't know that. Who'd want to stay down in the metro if we told them? We cannot tell them. If they are ready to make mince meat out of old ladies and kids to keep their secret, what do you think would they do to you, Uncle Sam? Huh? We can't go back. We can't use the radio. Remember the jammers? And even if you pull a perfect round ball and break through back into the metro, I'm actually it's never using them this long. Leave you and go. Yes, Moses, lead us out of this Egypt? Can Everyone lives in the cabin in the woods. Take your average station orders. Even if the Hansa guards didn't shoot them, how far would they get? Right to the nearest mutant den, most likely. Or at least in Finland, every house is a cabin in the woods, technically. Because we have so much forest. Not at all. Well, what if there was a proper evacuation? <laughs> and who would do that? Hansa's people? The ones that kept us under lock Except the people in Helsing. They have forests in this more far away. You have to settle them somewhere, provide food. You know, bro, I do get where you're coming from, but this matter is way more complex than it seems. I guess you're right. All this clean air went to my head. So, wait, does this mean the Colonel was in the know? His rank does seem to suggest that. Besides, yeah, Lord, did they ever stop? Where would we be without them after the D6 debacle? They gave us weapons, recruits to replenish our losses. We, on the other hand, our competence does not stretch beyond thinking cozy thoughts and keeping the fools in the metro from killing each other off. Remember, if not us, then who? That's a sentence you never hear, usually. You are too smart for your own good, idiot. No masks needed, the railroad runs through the whole country. Hmm, <laughs> as far as we want, I reckon. As for Yamantau, it's about 2,000 clicks away. No, I mean, how far can we get with the fuel we have? What's this machine's mileage? Ah, that. Uh, yeah, it certainly is a coal guzzler, this thing. But then again, there should be coal stores at every station. And if we don't find any, we could still burn firewood. What? Why the long face, Demir? <laughs> you see, I made a mistake of stocking up on filters. While I could have gotten a whole bunch of MREs for the same ammo, or, or a new hazard suit, I wish I'd known there'd be no need for them. The corporal sold them way too hard, that bastard. <laughs> Get them while they last. He even gave me a book as a free extra. Quotations from Chairman Mao, uh, 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 do you know this writer? Uh, Mao? Anyway, here I am like a fool with the stupid book and the filters. Well, we could really use that Milgrade ammo now. <laughs> you, you never know who or what we might meet. You're not giving the book enough credit. At the very least, it contains a whole world of wisdom on fighting the war against the imperialism. Which we might I have actually never listened before what they say. I've usually just jumped straight into the next yeah. level and Anna's pulling no punches this time. Perhaps she shouldn't have. It's not like the Cardinal understands everything. Mm. Who's in the right here? Uh whoever's not wrong, obviously. Well, who's not wrong then? Whoever who is the right in this well, the one who is in the room. Well, you must go, so nice ready. Thank you for stopping by as I appreciate it. Enjoy the sauna. And hopefully we'll see you again on Monday. Hello there, 
about him. It seems to me, whether it was intended or not, that Arcano now has a goal to strive for because of you. We all remember the way you fought back in D6, so no matter what lies ahead, we're with you. You can count on us. Yeah, yes. As for me, I'm running a little inventory check. Yeah, it is kind of cramped in here. Oh, inventory check keeps hugging the gun. Bench. So that's all the instruments we get, and everything else would be within arm's reach. With no workbench, you just lose small components. We'll use this place to work on the weapons. Cleaning, boiling, keep out of everybody's way, and keep them from messing with my stuff. Messing, uh, messing well, with stuff, he says, with my we'll stuff. Manage. But the subtitle said with stuff. So, if you find any weapons you like to keep, I'll store them for you here on the Aurora, and you can come back to exchange them. You'll get them back in their best shape ever, don't you doubt. Uh, boy, have I cleaned and oiled a lot of weapons in my life. Hmm, factory, and homemade too. Some of those were just amazing. Okay, so basically so if you make the mistake and start to listen to them, they will never so shut the fuck up. Well, hello there, Tom. Well, help yourself. I guess now I'm gonna be useful. Or like, do you get um, something out of doing it, or is it just some extra thing that you can do? Also, got to like it how like the freaking pile of gold doesn't get any emptier at any point. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly like fresh, fly intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they? while we were eating each other alive in the metro. We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau, if we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller, and we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed, that we'll get some answers? Nope. I think we should probably leave it somewhere here. Since the beginning of the chapter, and I think we are running in five hours. Looks like it. Rose, anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life. The life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Okay. 
friendly people. Shots fired! Four bogeys on a trolley! Yeah, still like the weird thing is, it says new game plus, and we got to keep all of the weapons from a last playthrough, and it's just simply. Right, I didn't. I have pistol. Where is my sniper? Gone. Brain is just trying to make a train pirate song. Oh dear. Just the perimeter guard. They could have put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run we into don't know them much why. earlier. Okay. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. But yes, I think we are gonna leave it for here for today, since we are already on five hours, and sadly I got the find something to eat and pretend that I have a life out of, outside of the video games and all that. But I think we could possibly raid someone. For the fun of it. So, let's see if it works. Because we got raided, so we could also raid forward. Okay, it works. So yeah, thanks for everyone who joined the stream today. I hope you all enjoyed. Thanks for all the follows, the subscriptions and the bits. And thank you overall for once again keeping the chat so positive. Really appreciate it. And next stream will be on Monday at the same time. And we are continuing Metro Exodus. So have a lovely rest of your weekend, everyone. And hopefully see you on Monday. Bye bye.